Hello YouTube, I hope you guys are doing well. Today we've got a sponsored stream from EA. We get to check out the new Hourglass map. Um, shout out to EA for inviting me to this. This Hourglass rework is coming out tomorrow so everybody can check it out. And I get to check it out today. They did want me to let you know that there could be technical problems with this stream just because it's on their test server. So there's a possibility that you know, some stuff will happen at some point during the stream. But other than that, I'm pretty excited. I gotta set up my classes, man. Do Falk and maybe give her the that gun for now. And uh, so the G57 is pretty good. There's also some other good ones, too. Okay. Everyone. Ready up. Hello, chat. Hope you guys are doing well. All right, let's check out this new hourglass map. So the stadium's way out here. I think that was one of the main things that people sort of first addressed. Let's see if we can get a little bird and just uh, scat things out. This layout is completely different. Like, not even remotely the same as before, so... Let's see how it plays. Oh, you know what? It's probably got different helicopter controls. Oh? I think it's okay? Oh, it is different, but that's okay. I'll just have to kind of get used to their heli controls for now. Okay, so that's their main base. Highway system is totally different. <laughs> yeah, I'm not gonna fly well because the controls are not what I, I'm used to. Okay, this is interesting. So that's where the, the highway was taken down. Hello, chat. Hope you guys are doing well. Alright, there's some guys down there. Yeah, we got a kill, even with janky heli controls. Probably want to be on the inside of this. Oh, somebody's shooting me up. I think I can get away though. Let's see. Let's see how this new area looks here. We'll go for a cap here. We have secured Fox Road sector. Oh shit, it's that thing down there. Let's see if we can get this little dude. Bye bye! Alright. Yoink. Oh, we almost got that guy. Where's my secondary? I think it's these. I haven't messed with any of the settings yet on these vehicles. We may need to bail. Okay. Oh. Poor AI. <laughs> oh yeah, how many AI are in here? Okay, so it this is a um, invite-only event, so a certain percentage of the players are going to be... Uh, not here. Also, it's possible that it's we're playing on a smaller server because we're on the U.S. side. And at the moment, most of the 2042 players, or at least content creators, seem to be in the U.K. or um, Europe, anyway. Let's see. I'll respawn here. And we'll probably go Engineer and uh, that thing for now. So we have something to fight vehicles, because we're probably going to run into quite a bit of vehicles. Oh, shit. Oh, it's AI. Uh -huh. Okay, so this... So the city seems to be a much bigger... Integration of the conquest here, at least the the ground level city stuff. Reloading now. I didn't see if there was a um 
a rooftop cap point though. It doesn't look like it, right? I don't see any rooftop cap points, so I think it's just all ground level. Yoink, there's a real player. I am, um, because they were worried about their sort of, um, test server tech. I am noticing a little bit of lag on here, but it's not a big deal. Unless that's just the lean mechanic that I haven't turned off. Okay, so we got three cap points there, two on the other side. That's interesting. Kind of an asymmetrical design, but since our spawn points are on the bottom. Okay, it is an equal design. Since the map is being divided vertically. Our forces are targeting Fox Trot 1. Oh, that was actually a pretty good shot on his part. Our situation. Going There's ahead. definitely um, some visual effects that I'm not like loving at the moment, but. Okay. Okay, we'll keep it where it is for now. Jerk, you think uh, Matt and I are going to play some Star Citizen? We will. Um, I'm going to wait until something happens in the game that interests me. Somebody's pushing me now. Yeah, I feel a little bit of um, you owe me. delay on my movement right here. I think that's just their server stuff, but they did warn us that it might happen on the beta servers. There's definitely a lot more, like, clutter and stuff happening in this area. That's an AI, I think, but... There's a guy right there. Okay. There's that little bird. One more guy in the point somewhere. Oh, shit. That would be a tank. Put the turret up here real quick. And get the reload going. Oh nice, they took out the chopper. Turret did shoot somebody just there. Nobody's on the point still. Okay. I see their tank. About 50. Is that an AI tank? It might be an AI tank. I can't quite tell. There we go. Yeah, it is an AI tank. That was close. I'm reloading. Still quite open in certain areas. And I see the zip line stuff up there, but I wonder if that's just for like people who want to camp. I should go up in the in the tower and just see what the access is like. I think one of the things they said was that they removed a bunch of the sand toward the base of the buildings. This area looks different, right? I don't remember this fountain from before. All right, should we see if we can get up in one of these buildings and uh, see what the building access is like? Nope, those are cut off. Okay, so this one is probably a fly-in only. I'll go check out one of the other ones. Our enemy controls the battlefield. They have conquered more sectors. Very We're taking too many casualties. Okay. So, oh, these, uh... These things are kind of new, actually. This is like little barricade tower areas. These are cool. Well, I don't have any more ammo. I can't put this down, though. Yeah, this is kind of cool up here. This area. Go turret. Shoot the armor. Pretty vehicle-heavy map, for the most part. This area looks very cool. 
so much more cover here now. Oh, dang it. Uh, yeah, there are 128 maps. Uh, I it, Will this be a 128 player map? I assume so. Um, I don't think they've taken... I think they've made sure that the original maps will be 128, but some of the newer maps I don't think support the 128 modes. I think that's what it is. Yeah, this area is cool now. I like this. The highway looks great. We got all this cover on the highway now. Is somebody up there? I think it's a crate or something. Oh, that's neat. This looks like a BF5 asset right there. Be nice if I could hit that guy out there. Can't quite see him now. Little bird's doing a little flyby on somebody. Yoink! Hello. I think there is a tank back there, though. Oh, I think they got him. All right, nice. I'm getting loaded. Antenna up there. So this area is pretty dope. Got like a nice like overhang area. Where are all my shots missing? Did you see that? Did they adjust the art? I think, um, that's right. There's some weapon balance coming with this patch tomorrow, so maybe that's what I'm playing with right now. I'm surprised that none of those shots hit after the first one, though. We have superiority in this battle. Make sure we maintain it. Put them there. Sentry ready! Yeah, this whole area looks awesome. Very different. Oh, nice. Okay, can we go down? Whoa, 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 whoa. How's he shooting me through the smoke? Oh, it's dead already? Okay. Oh. I think that guy just died as he came over here. Alright, let's take a little vehicle so we can um, explore a little faster, maybe. Check out this part of the map now. So this goes towards their deployment. Their kind of new deployment location. Still a lot of wide open desert, so they're not getting rid of that part of the map. It just seems like if you follow a certain path, you'll more or less. Oh no. Am <laughs> stuck in here? US troops in control. <sighs> oh, it's just AI. Alright. Kind of boring fight in AI. Let's get back in. So this does look a little different. It's just not like um, a monumental shift on that part of the town. It's just so close now, basically. So the big open stretches of desert would, I guess, be here. <laughs> yeah, don't text and drive, guys. Okay, now they own those three points. Okay. So it's kind of interesting. Like, these are the gimmies now. Oh, I see. There's two spawns. There's spawn here, spawn there, spawn there, spawn there. Okay, so you can you can attach, you can attack both gimmies, but the vehicle spawns are on this side of the map. Could take a tank out. Let's see. It is, I mean, the fact that the stadium's not in the map anymore is really disappointing. 
I think it's because they're basing it on, like, because it's based on the real city, they didn't want to, uh... Fuck. My sensitivity in the tank's all wonky right now. That chopper go. Uh, high tank. It must be an AI, that's why he's sitting right there, right? Really? Oh, I don't have the thermal uh, stuff on. Oh no, the storm! Did I run that guy over or shoot him? Okay, so they still do the desert storm. Can't even see these guys, man. Yeah, we're done. Making games for older gen. Hmm. Needs combat halfway up the towers. I will say it is a little disappointing that the um, tower combat is like totally out of it. I think they just could never quite figure out how to uh, integrate it properly. We'll do C5, I guess. Um, something. Uh, can we save A1? Oh, this storm is not going to be great for sniping. The enemy pushed us off Alpha 1. Dude, the stealth choppers are the bane of this game, man. Oh, <laughs> he did crit. Did that guy eject? Ah, got screwed in the thing. My sensitivity is all janky right now. I'm not really sure. You know what it might be? Is it might be like one of those um. There's like weird things or it's like relative aiming, I think. I just haven't touched it in forever. Mouse raw input on. Yeah, there's like one that's like soldier relative aiming. I just don't remember where it is right now. Eh, it's not important. I want to look at the map. Still got this unfortunate storm. <laughs> All right. Yeah, the fact that Stadium's not in it is, I mean, it's its a disappointment. We'll go back to support, or engineer, I think, just since it's all CQB here. This fight along the central point is kind of neat, though. Oh my gosh, that chopper seems like it's almost dead. Get this reloaded. Can we get the tank? An objective is All just the shooting beach. tanks, man. Wow, there's there's kind of a lot of latency here. I felt my gun like shoot like half a second after I tried to pull the trigger that time. Okay, let's see. And again, EA wanted me to stress this, that this was a, they're using a new test system for this capture thing and that they were, they were anticipating that there might be some bugs with it. The process for connecting this time was very different than the previous sessions that I've had. So they're doing something now. Hmm. 
Tango has been secured by hostile. How's it going, chat? Let's see if we can get a, a little bird to look at some of this stuff again. I'll go see if I can get over to the uh, the tops of the towers. Those buildings are new, right? They're not in bounds, but I are those new set dressing buildings? They kind of seem like it. I ended up I stopped playing this map basically with the original game, so I'm not as familiar with it because it just wasn't as fun. Uh, doesn't look like there's elevators to get up on these ones. I mean, obviously, you'll be able to stand on them, I assume. But let's see. Like, I just want to see if the elevators get you up here. Yeah, okay, this one's still elevator accessible. For the most part, it looks the same. There might be some changes, but I, I'm not noticing them. Might be some like subtle changes. What is this jet up to? What are we doing here, buddy? Uh, there's another jet coming after me. Wow, the sound effects on that jet sound kind of wonky. There he is. Oh, that guy's down. Do I not get an assist on him? That thing, it's an AA tank. Get behind the thing. Ow. Wow, that hit me still. Staging attack on Fox Trump One. Alright. I don't actually want to cap this because that's really boring. I'd rather explore the map. Oh, there's a chopper. Where'd he go? He went back. He's over here now. There he is. Whoo! That was close. I don't have my my normal chopper control, so it's all gonna be kind of off. Look at that! Oh, we got that guy. Ah, Bridget! Who's hitting me? Ah, oh, it's a jet. Go this way. Oh my god, did you see that latency? <laughs> this is what EA was talking about with the servers. I feel that in every firefight, this weird delay between stuff. The delay on that shoot was crazy. We now control Foxtrot Sector. Do. Alright, spawn on me, squad. Oh, somebody's here. I think he's overhead. Alright, teammate got one guy. Okay. <laughs> Thank you, Broken Machine. Appreciate it, buddy. The American forces have rival sector. All right, we got it. So we got. Whoa! 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 Get off of your ATV, bro. Oh, come on, man. Um, yeah, I know Broken Machine. He's a good guy. And I know most of the, uh, content creators for Battlefield.
Can we get the little bird again? I feel like it's the best way to observe the map. And blow up other little birds. It is harder to aim with my not, not my controls. The jet coming in at me. Get out of here, bro. You guys are being annoying. All these jet pilots everywhere. Really dominating the air. The skies. We're gonna get the cap here? I think we will. Just to control, I see somebody on the radar though. I can't tell if he's on the roof or if he dropped down. G1's getting burned now. Somebody went in there. He's not peeking. Yeah, I don't know where he went. There's a guy in the desert. Yoink. 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 Woo! The miniguns are so much better than they were when this game first launched. It's kind of nice. They will not win the next. Why are you not getting the update? Because the update doesn't launch till tomorrow, guys. This is a early. Uh, first look at the map. But everybody else gets to play tomorrow. Do wield pistols for this game? No thanks. Rip the stadium. Yeah, that is the most disappointing aspect of this map update is the fact that they're just like, oh, the stadium's too far away. I don't think anybody would have cared if they moved the stadium in closer because this is, I forget which city this actually is based on. But um, I think they're just trying to be like true to the design of the original city, but I think for the most part, people don't care. It's like, put the put the stadium here. It is one of the cooler combat elements. Now we get serious. Now we get serious. Doha. Is that it? Okay. Hey, Jason. How you doing, man? Yeah, the stadium was like the single good thing about the first map. So the fact that we're not seeing it in the rework is pretty disappointing. But, um, I mean, it's it looks like a just general improvement to the overall map layout. It's just like it doesn't have um, much iconic visuals, you know? I feel like that's always been kind of like a thing of Battlefield maps is there's usually like an iconic element to it and now it just feels like oh here's a here's a highway in the desert it's kind of blown up and there's some barricades and stuff around it and you're like okay but i don't know the city of doha has been evacuated i think it'll be generally speaking a far more enjoyable experience now now when it queues up for hourglass i'm not going to be like oh man it's hourglass it'll be like oh it's hourglass like let's see how this plays Battle bit OP. <laughs> I have been playing a lot of Battle bit lately. Not gonna lie. Oh yeah. Oh, there's their air vehicles. Right. They spawn over there now. Our jet just went for him, man. Maybe I should back off. Oh, we have a... There's another chopper next to me. Okay. We got a friendly chopper. Okay, let's see. Is this... Oh, he's coming for me. Oh, he shot me out of it. Good shot. 
The enemy holds the majority of sectors. Which you could blow up the arches. That would be really cool. That would be a nice levolution event here for sure. Okay, let's spawn here. Oh my god, there's so many tanks right there. This is still going to be a really tough part of the map to, like, navigate. Shit, is there a tank going around? Oh, we got that. Oh crap, tank's right there. God. Well, I'm out of rockets now. Exactly what he said. Oh, there's too many tanks here, man. Seems like we're kind of fighting the tanks off a little bit. And this has always been a cool combat area. God, there's tanks everywhere, man. Let's see if we can get more ammo somewhere. Not enough rockets. Can't see too much dust. Oh my god, tanks right there. Crap. If only I had something to kill a tank with, man. I mean, those turrets are kind of jokes at this point. I could play Liz with mines. It'd be pretty annoying, though. I think I saw somebody over there. Command is watching. Oh, he's on top of the building. All right, he's dead. Sure, we'll do a relay. All right, buddy. I'm here. Oh God, the tanks, man, the tanks. Alright, I think they just blew that one up, maybe? That tunnel area is much cooler now. You can actually hide in it, which is a nice change. Yeah, it still feels super exposed out here, though. Yeah. Am I excited for the finals? Yeah, man. Finals is... I've... I thoroughly enjoyed the finals of every single beta that I've played. It's it's really good. I hope it has staying power. That's the hardest thing for games these days is they're like, people are like, cool, and then they like move on, you know? So I hope the finals can kind of stick around because it really is a fun, unique concept. Okay, that was a hostile. U.S. forces have the edge. We'll need to secure more objectives quickly. Shit. They're getting multiplied into like three people. <laughs> Freaking chopper got me. This is going to be a vehicle heavy map. Holy crap. Can I spawn with a vehicle? What do we got? Uh... I don't know if the brawler is the right choice, but we can get the AA tank. Why is it so slow right now, man? Okay, he, he disabled my turret or whatever. Someone's got to put these guys down. 
Crap, they got tanks up though. It's not great. See if we can get out of the armor area. And here comes that dust storm. <laughs> it's gonna make the map so much cooler. Hey, thanks for the five. Wait, destruction in a battlefield game? This isn't battle bit. Yeah, battle bit's destruction is pretty fantastic. I mean, it's not like high fidelity, but the fact that you can destroy almost everything is pretty, pretty cool. All right. Will that not heavily damage those vehicles? Come on. There we go. There we go, finally. Oh my gosh, look at all these dudes out here. Now, does this thing still suck at infantry? Kind of seems like it. That's alright, though. Look, frog! Never mind. There's a little bird out there. Is he coming in? Saw him momentarily. Oh, there's another little bird. Let's see if we can. Coming in. Oh, he's over there. Let's see if we can get him. That would be great. That's going to hit the building for sure. Yeah, this is their... They like hiding here. They can hide real good. Why is it not locking on? What does that mean? If it doesn't lock. Oh, it's because he's too close to the ground. Right, right, right. Forgot about that. I don't play AA tanks that much. And that's a uh, one of the newer updates to 2042. They let choppers get a little bit of protection that they fly low. Get back here. Yeah, that gun really is pretty weak against those guys. Alright. We have been hit by the storm. Will I be able to take out any helicopters out here? Camera's kind of wonky right now. Somebody's out there. <laughs> Somebody shot at me. I think a jet shot at me, but... Oh, somebody got that guy. There's the chopper. He's flying too low. Okay. Hopefully, once you lock on, going low doesn't break the lock. Those locks are so fast with the AA vehicle, though, man. The city does look pretty cool. But as a tank, I don't want to be in line of sight of that thing. I think a tank just shot me in the back. Yikes! Bail out, boys! I heard somebody. I don't even know if I need the lock. The lock, I don't think, makes me do more damage, so. Okay. Oh. I don't know why I shot at that guy. Waste my last rocket. So hard to shoot pilots out in 2042. I miss shooting pilots out, man. Sector is now under 
out of control. I did get a hit on him there. Maintain your position. Charlie Vaughn is no longer secure. Maybe got a little lock on him, that's cool. We have lost half our resources. Attack on Charlie One initiated by our troops. It's off, bro. Oh. oh. Oh, that green light was a guy. I should have known. Do I ever go back to BF4? It's been quite a while since I've gone back to BF4. Our troops now control Echo Sector. Let's see. What should I take? What's interesting? I guess the tank's a little interesting. Let's see if we can get our desert tank warfare going. I think what this map kind of is, is it's kind of like the vehicle map now, but just with better balance. So infantry actually has something to do. They're not just completely dominated by vehicles the whole time. That's fine. I mean, Battlefield's always had vehicle-oriented maps. They've never been my favorite, but um, they've always had them, you know. Players want those maps that are more about, like, a big tank offensive or something. Look at that chopper guy. There's a little bird out there. Oh, come on, man. That seems so close. Ow. Wow. What weapon is that? Just can mess you up, man. Probably get my thermal. Probably should have had my thermal smoke equipped. That guy crashed for sure. What? <laughs> He's alive somehow. Delta has been secured by our soldiers. Oh, I felt close. Aww. Real gun tank. Gotta watch out. Oh, he laser beamed me through that. Support package ready. You gotta be careful. Ah, I want the clutch shot. Oh, I can't aim up high enough. I don't have the thermal smoke. It's so stupid that there's normal smoke and then thermal smoke. It's like, just make it all thermal. Why would anyone pick normal smoke over thermal smoke? Oh no, the railgun tank's about to end me. Let's see if I can um, mess with the... Air to ground missile. There we go. Okay. That's what I actually want. There we go. That's what the chopper's using. I've got my air to ground missile now. Out of range, but we should go for the chopper first. Oh, he dead. Yeah, so this is the really annoying thing that they get. Vehicle part disabled. Okay, and then I gotta wait for it to recharge. Almost. How many, how many shots does it take to kill that thing? I haven't used these in a while. Oh shit, there's a chopper on me. 
This, this is the good guy. He's laser beaming me. Foxtrot sector has fallen. U.S. troops in control. Yeah, this is a streaming build of 2042 right now, guys. Sorry if that wasn't clear. We have superiority. Uh, this update sure and this take. map is launching tomorrow for everyone else. So I get to stream it for two hours total for the whole stream. So we get to check it out. Dang it. Worst time to spawn is recon. We did tag him. Well, he just got out of the AA tank and gave it to our team. All right. There's their tank out there. You know, considering the latency right now on this server, Sniper is probably not a very good class to play. Kill his dog, too. <laughs> oh, that landed on top of the thing. I'm like, tanks are just raining out of the sky. Yeah, railgun tanks taking shots at me. Oh, get headshotted, bro. I yeah, actually almost won that. Screw that tank, man. <laughs> He's just sitting there. We can't do anything. Oh, I'm Pike. I don't know why I'm Pike. All right. So I'm going to get laser beamed by that railgun tank as soon as he sees me. There's no cover here. This is still a pretty open push. This is a tricky one. Oh, shit. What got me? Oh, somebody over there. What's the rework? It's still the same damn sand dunes. Well, I mean, it's a desert map. They're not going to make it a snow map. Um, the rework is, is pretty substantial. This is the map layout right here. I really want to get the little bird again, but that one pilot is he's set up. I'd have to rebind my keys if I to try and beat him. Oh shit, he's doing barrel rolls. Oh, look at the latency. It's it's throwing me off. I can't actually get on target while he hits me. Due to the crazy latency. Yeah, that same pilot. I can't beat him. Whoa. Adobe Creative Cloud is trying to update my software. Come on, bro. Enemy tanks located. About 90 meters from my. Oh, there's a sniper in there. Now, I mean, I the map is without question an improvement, but it is still a vehicle-heavy map which means it needs to be a little bit more open or it's 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 supposed to be a vehicle map right so like more open a little more favorable for vehicle gameplay Ow. but infantry do have more cover there's just seems to still be those points between objectives where there are some exposed areas um They did mention like trying to like continue working on balance between the infantry and vehicles, so it's hard to know how all of that's gonna shape up. Oh my god. Dang. 
Yeah, the stadium thing, Gib, is kind of like the biggest upset, right? It's like, why the heck isn't stadium still on the map? But it is what it is. We gotta get that tank, man. Take this, shithead! Those <laughs> turrets do so little to tanks, man. Oh shit, there's a guy right there. It's so laggy. Look at my movement here. Oh, he's dead. Okay. I still have that little overhang area. Oh, shit. That was a bunch of guys right there. Oh, my God. Yeah, unfortunately, I can't really um, play at a high level with the mana latency on the test server. DICE did want me to reiterate this a couple times that this is a test server and they were anticipating that there could be some issues with it, which the latency thing is. So it's more of a good experience to look at the map and not pay attention to the latency I'm experiencing right now. GG. Can't remember if they said we we're going to try a different mode on this map or not, or if it's just Conquest the whole time. I'd be curious to see what Breakthrough looks like, though. Like, I wonder if Stadium is still in Breakthrough. That'd be neat. Because the Stadium sequence in the Breakthrough part of the map was one of the coolest ones from a visual perspective. It didn't play out particularly well, but it had, like, a fun concept where people were, like, airdropping off the Stadium to the first objective. Make sure that, uh, warnings, blah, blah. Okay, they're going to switch through to breakthrough at the end of this match. Okay, cool. Here we go. Yeah. I know you wanted to see breakthrough. It's basically, uh, I'm at the will of whatever the devs are doing with the servers right now. So two rounds of conquest and now we're doing breakthrough. So will there be a bigger 128 player conquest layout? Um, I believe they're always going to offer the 128 player conquest on the original maps. So I believe they're still offering that with this. I don't know if it's bigger or if it's the same size or what. But I mean, personally, like just joining 128 player servers in 2042 has been pretty hard to do anyway. You're going to get such a high quantity of bots. What is going on with this menu? This is so weird. <laughs> I assume this is just the beta menu. It like keeps panning back and forth. It's making me sick. I'm like, stop moving menu.
there any difference in squad comms? Oh, I didn't test it out, but they do... I think this patch is coming with the new squad update stuff. Uh, I believe it was this patch and not like season six or whatever, where you're going to be able to lock and kick people from your squad and stuff. There we go. All right, is Stadium gonna be in Breakthrough? We'll see. I'm gonna guess no. Be just based on what the layout of the map looked like, but I could be wrong. We will find out together. I've worked with worse. Well, let's start it's off with Engineer because I don't know what I'm gonna run into yet. I do need to upgrade that pistol. Yeah, stadium's way over there. They're supporting. But they're hiding something. They deployed an entire assault force to occupy the region. Push the enemy back and secure the site. They'll try to slow you down. Don't let them. Stay focused. Stay aggressive. Transport is waiting. What's the difference between RPG and M5? Uh, which RPG are you talking about, man? Every sector we advance. Russians will fall back. Take your objectives, keep the enemy running. Oh, they bailed out of that one. That's our vehicle. I miss the days in which a tank round would insta kill a uh, a light transport, you know? Like a jeep. That used to be just the standard. Now they can take a tank round and they're like... They have enough time to jump out of it. Somebody's over there. Get a little closer. We'll move in. We'll get some cat points. All right. <laughs> we have secured the sector. Lol. Can we blow up that trailer? That'd be nice. Yeah. Totally somebody under there. Oh no, this guy just got blown up. Come on guys, come on infantry, support us. This push seems pretty similar in many regards, to be honest. They just kind of fast forward you to it instead of playing at the big open area from before. There is dead. Uh, there's somebody right next to us. I think they're over in the pit, though. All right, infantry's pushing up. We can go now. Oof, I can't even see through the smoke. Oh, got that dude. Can't see. Why is the reload not happening? There is a dude right there, though. Hello? I don't want to get too far away from infantry. Now I need to back up. Right. Oh, I'm hacked. I'm hacked. All right, we did get a hit on him, though. Get the 
flip out of my sight, bro. Yeah, I'm hacked again. He's holding that angle. I mean, really, I shouldn't peek it. Not sure who keeps hacking me, though. Somebody over there. Could be a drone, too. I have no idea. Now the best, in my opinion, the best way to play a tank is to support infantry, not overcommit. As soon as you find yourself away from your friendly infantry, then you're basically you're in trouble. I can't see anyone down there. Thought I would get a nice overview. All right. Well, we're fully repped again, so we're ready to go. Lol. Laser beam that guy. Who shot that? I can't even see the dude. Alright. We have incoming! We got her. I think that was a list. Oh no. They're trying to take me down. Bravo two I mean, I think I can rep. Unless they're on top of me. Oh, there's a drone nearby. Taking an objective. We're burning resources to stay in I just don't want to lose my tank, especially if some of these guys are like watching me play. I see their top. 110 meters. So you're gonna keep backing out or no? Yeah, I'm getting, um, I think it's the drone. I don't see any drone. We'll be okay. All right, team's made some nice progress up here. This is a cool cap point. This is the first area that feels significantly different compared to before. Oh, I so desperately want to go for that Jeep. What? I don't even understand. I need to back out a little more. Thing. Oh, he's got to be close. Oh, I overshot it. Terrible. If he gets this kill, he deserves it, man. I missed too many shots there. A lot of guys out in the open there. Oh, there's the other armor. Found! Ah, about 70 meters from your position. There we go. Spotted a hostile fire team. That's just AI. Look at all this. I think that's just AI coming in. It's really weird that the reload seems to be like semi-delayed on some of that stuff. All right, there goes that thing. There, I think there's a guy on the highway above us, though. I gotta watch out. They just took out that air transport. That's wild, man. I think was there for like three seconds. Guys, so close to being dead. All right, maybe going down here is a mistake. Maybe it's not. We'll see. Yeah, there's definitely a guy out there, so we gotta watch out. Okay, we got it. Sector secured, boys. 
Now, can I go up on the bridge? Or is that a huge mistake? We will see. LOL! Get headshotted, bro. Disabled. What? Vehicle destroyed. He's gonna try and peek it again, isn't he? Ah, dang. Got a good hit there. Oh no, that's not good. Should back up now. Let's see if we can save it. Got. Technical velocity. Still time, but our forces are paying a cost. Thank you, whoever did that. Oh, bonk. whoa, you can take the door off the back of that? I don't think I ever knew that. Kind of cool. So this push is still, it's similar where the snipers up on the buildings are shooting down at guys. So there's that, but there's a lot more cover. Like, look at that. That's a pillbox right near there that the guy's inside of. Which is kind of cool. Couldn't tell if a guy was still in that tower. Kind of disappointing that you can't. Tower still up after a tank shot? Oh wow, these guys are not getting stopped. Come on, guys. Taking fire up I'm way closer to these guys than I want to be right now. Uh, highway might actually not be the best approach here. I'm totally disabled. Can barely move. Nice. Somebody's got a rep going, I think. Or the tank's auto repping. Yeah, I'd be pretty exposed to anyone on a office building right now. So, if those guys were shooting at me. I'm gonna try going over the edge though, cause it's just a little too risky up here. Oh, those are just bodies, okay. I was like, they're moving. Nice, gunners are, gunners are cleaning up. Good job, Gunners. Incoming fire! Oh shit, I'm stuck on the truck. I was like, I'll just back out now. That guy hit me pretty solidly through the truck, but I think I just got him. Hit that guy. Come on, guys. Can't tell if that guy's through the truck or not. I think somebody just went in that container. Shoot. You gotta watch out for those guys. Those guys can kill you pretty quick if you're... Dang. Not on it. Where is he? Ah, oh, that would have been a sick hit! Dang it, I don't have thermal smoke. Right. Our troops are advancing on Charlie One. What am I stuck on? Oh, this stupid thing, man. Oh, he got it. <sighs> Can I show you the new squad management? Uh maybe. Got Squid G in here, broken machine. Okay, so squad full. So I'm not the squad leader. So I can't mess with it, but I can create a new squad. I can mess with stuff. I mean, I think it's just what Dice said from before, which is basically like mute stuff, or you could kick people uh, and lock the squad for the most part. How have we not capped this point yet, man? They're shooting at us! Oof. Alright, that RPG. 
RPG's doing some damage. Uh, let's see. Um, Red box. On my position. How long has the RPG been in the game? Someone was asking about it earlier, and I just don't actually remember using it. Is it new for this patch? Oh, shit. Okay. Ow. Oh, yeah, yeah. You should be getting points for marking stuff. Let's see. Came out with season five. Okay, the RPG. Our troops are engaging in Charlie One. Multiple About 70 meters from your position. Oh god. I mean that guy just drove us drove us in there a crazy spot. 120, it would be amazing on this. Mm, yeah, maybe. I don't know if our team's going to be able to break through here. Come on, men. It's pretty far back now. We get to try it from the infantry perspective now instead of the vehicle perspective. These guys are just, they got way too much freedom out there, man. Also, did they nerf the RPT or did I just not set it up the, the way that I had from before? Freaking doggo. We got 40 rounds left. Okay, the storm might actually change it up. Let us get in a little closer. Somebody's going to pop out here in a second. All right, storm, let's go. Here we go. Yeah, the storm, the storm changed things. That's kind of interesting, actually. Oh, shit. That was a friendly. Get that RPG reloaded. All right, we got it. Yay, Storm. Storm for the win. Oh my god, I can't even see these guys. going to shoot me out of this. Oh! Yo! <laughs> that guy's upset. Aw. That was funny, though. Well, that guy's got an M-Tire with that big old suppressor on it. That's right. I guess I can, um... They added all the uh, weapon modding to the, like, the classic stuff. So I guess I should look at that a little bit. So let's see. Um, so the AK with. Okay, God, the system in this still drives me crazy. We can get that on there. And we can do 40 round if we want. Is this one new? Or have they had the. Uh, no, they had the AK before. There's like a new. Underway. They brought the rest of the weapons into the weapon modding thing. And I forget which ones are the new ones, to be honest. I have not been quite as plugged into the battlefield news as of late. Oh, here we go. Oh my god! Oh, that delay on the parachute is terrifying. Ouch. SMGs and sidearms. Are those the new ones that got the update? It'll be interesting. So let's see if uh, this one here. Okay, so. An optic. Get the 40 round. Cobra. We'll try Cobra. And then what? So you get an option now. You can do wrap suppressor on there. It's probably still not going to be that great, but we'll see. Uh, 
Are we losing this cap now? Four guys. Mm. They just forced us <laughs> off, Delta 2. Did the 1911 get an extended mag? I don't know. We could try that. Light LM LMHs. Which is LMHs? Ooh, wow. 17 round for a 1911? Is that even possible? Let's see. There's a lot of shots from a 1911, bro. Oh shit. <laughs> I was not expecting to see somebody right there. Oh, I guess. Alright. Yeah, as much as I love the AKS, I don't think it's gonna be a power. That was, that was an AI guy. Yeah. <laughs> it's getting beat out by uh, P90s, man. Now, the P90 was actually one of the better um, portal weapons. So let's see what this one gets as uh, attachments. Nice. Right, so it gets the better... Does it get the better red dot? DD hollow or the fusion hollow? I can't remember. Okay. No magma. Yeah, that wouldn't make any sense. Laser and then tactical muzzle break. Hostiles are taking an objective. The hostiles can't hold us back. Keep pushing, and we'll win it. Right. I can't remember which of this stuff was part of the default. But yeah, getting that uh, a little red dot on the P90 is kind of nice. What did it have before? I think it might have had the, like, Cobra or something, so not quite as as good. Oh, shit. Probably shouldn't have reloaded. Oh, this guy's coming in. No, he's not coming in. All right. Somebody's in there. <laughs> Total chaos in this smoke, man. <laughs> this death cam thoughts are kind of weird. Oh, interesting. It's interesting how that icon changes. No, I got shot from behind. Dang. Yeah, I don't know if it's the hipfire spread on the P90 versus some of the weird latency going on right now. Um, again, this is sort of like a test server thing. And DICE was pretty nervous about doing this because <laughs> their test server apparently isn't set up in the same way that their like, public servers are. And so there's a lot of latency problems with it. So they're like... They were nervous about showing off the game on their test server, but they were kind enough to continue with it. But the caveat that uh, we let you guys know that it's all test server stuff. I don't know if we're going to get this, man. Oh, that's so close. He's got to be almost dead. Ah, oh, we almost made it. I assume that was the last capture point, though. Well, Breakthrough definitely plays much better than before. I mean, before, you just had those giant open stretches of just, like, getting vehicle sniped or just getting actually sniped or just getting dominated by, like, a, an aircraft that would fly by. So that's nice. It is disappointing that the stadium couldn't have been worked into the map, though. Like, because on the other maps, they moved, like, the oil derrick, you know, on Breakaway. 
and like that was cool they like brought it in closer so it's like it would be cooler if they could have brought that stadium in closer but i kind of get it i get it the map is better um i think it's kind of falling victim to like what i thought it might which is like you take one of the worst maps in battlefield 2042 and you rework it and it's now a decent map it's not like amazing right so it's like if you want an amazing map you probably have to start over from the ground up and make a completely new map so it's a decent salvage job it uh the stadium thing is just sad because it was really cool um and it doesn't seem like building top stuff is quite as focused which may be a That's good thing or case. a bad thing depending on how much you like building top sniping and stuff I think we got one more round of breakthrough. One or two more rounds. How are the vault LMGs now? Um, let's see, which one do you want me to check out? Let me know. I'll check out one of the new vault weapons. Okay, the stadium was removed due to resource limits on last gen version of the game. Thank you, uh, BSOD Gaming. Appreciate that. Yeah, that's one of those annoying things about um, console limits and stuff like that. They've come to learn their lesson, and I have plenty to teach them. M240 Bravo. Russia is crying foul over technology. Yeah, we'll start with the 240 Bravo. But they're hiding something. They deployed an entire assault force to occupy the region. What do we got? Try to slow you down. These are Don't not my favorite them. optics, Stay to focused. be honest. Stay if I just wanted a basic red dot, waiting. it's not really there. Ghost hybrid? Smart? We'll try the smart. So, okay, it gets the extended mag now, which is nice. We'll probably give it the basic mag. Under barrel, we can get Cobra or that. The That one's just hip fire. Okay. Accuracy while static. We'll do that one. And then we got basic barrel. I'll put the Warhawk compensator here and just see if that's a benefit overall. Oh, and the tactical comp. Okay, we'll play around with Warhawk and tactical comp. I already did the AK-74U. Alright, troops. Focus on your objectives. Ow! I'm one over there. How? <laughs> Thank you. I don't like the aiming on the RPG, I'll say that, man. I haven't really used the RPG much. Does it have slightly higher damage or something like that? Or faster reload, maybe. We need to set to secure it to move forward. Watch for hostiles. Okay. okay, the tank is dead over there. Everybody's playing engineer right now. They're like, screw the tanks. Give me another RPG, there we go. Ow. Bravo on assault initiated by our troops. Hello. Okay, so you can cap from above. And I think it also has the below cap zone area too. It's probably where the seven dudes are. I think jumping down there might be suicide. Oh, yep. We didn't need to. I just wanted to see if we could go down there and check it out a bit. Our troops have occupied Bravo 1. Yeah, I will say with the like the amount of effort they talked about for this rework, it just doesn't feel particularly I mean, there is a lot like doing debris and stuff. It just doesn't feel quite as like, "Oh my god, what an amazing rework." <laughs>
It's like they they just added a lot of debris and stuff around the highway, built a little base thing there, and kind of messed with it. But yeah, with kind of like talking about saving the biggest for last, it's like well they cut out most of the map, so reworking a giant map would be one thing. But if you just cut out like a third or a half of the map. Well, now it's way less work. You don't have to rework that part. So ultimately, the size of the map now really isn't that huge. So it is kind of weird that this rework took as long as it did. Or they just saved it to last because they thought it was going to take the longest and then realized that they ultimately just had to cut down this, the scale of the map. Here we, we got our big desert area. A lot of desert flanking options out there. So if you want to go off on the side and snipe or use a vehicle, it's still an option. All objectives captured. Oh. Sector is under our control. Marking enemy tank. Hey, we got a hit. We can get our RPG back before we head to the next one. Bling. Push them back, but not far. Secure this sector. Ow. We are attacking Charlie. This is a weird push here. It's sort of like our cover is kind of a wonky. It's like you're either below the bridge or on top of the bridge. Maybe it's designed to be that way and then like the storm rolls in and makes it easier or something. Oh my god. Hello. It's just blind, dude. Those are AI. Okay. You can tell by the way they stand out in the open. up there. Nice. Oh, there's a sniper way up there fighting that thing. Hmm. Alright, we got it, boys. Guess I'll go for a reload. Yeah, 240 Bravo feels far more usable. I don't know if it's going to be like an RPT replacement, but, um... Like, you see right there, I can drop that dude at range pretty effectively. This is the final sector. Fire on that building looks kind of new. I think that's new. We are initiating an attack on Delta-1. Can't even see that guy, man. There we go. Oh, it's an AI. Eat it, AI. I don't want to run out there. That's super exposed. So we got to the left. Okay, so this area here, how they like carved out new areas in the sand dune, is much better. This whole area is so much better designed. It's nice to see. Last round, I think I was in a vehicle or something, so I didn't get to progress through it. But this whole area before was like one of the worst areas of any battlefield map I've ever played on Breakthrough. There's just no cover. It was just like flat dunes most of the time. Man, how did that guy not die? Oh, that's an anti-tank grenade, I think. Let's put this turret out there. Ready for action. What do you see, turret? Oh, there was a guy right there. Hey, wall hacks. Somebody behind? I think somebody's right behind me. No, I don't have any grenades left. Oh, we did get the. Oh, we got it. 
Victory! Final <laughs> there comes the we storm. Control of the area. Mission accomplished. Yeah, the 240 Bravo in real life is fire 762 by 54 millimeter. It's a belt-fed sniper rifle. Yeah. No, I know you could lay down at a very long distance with the 240 Bravo and just suppress. 762 by 51. Yeah, man, nobody knows round type. I don't know those round types. It's a big round, though. There are different smokes. Well, there's grenade smokes, and then there's the grenade launcher smokes. I think those are slightly different, right? Scale is 1 out of 10. Yeah, I... It does feel like, well, the conquest version is big, is bigger than the breakthrough version, obviously. Yes. Um, Time for action. But it is smaller than it was before. It's hard to know how to do those really big scale maps right. They had some in like that BF3 DLC that was like the armored focus one. It's called like armored kill or something. And those were pretty big and they had some like good city areas but what happened is like basically vehicles would dominate the outskirt objectives and infantry just wouldn't want to go there and they would all just fight around like a couple of the internal objectives it's hard to know how to do it right man they've come to learn their lesson and i have plenty to teach Russia is crying foul over a technology shipment trapped in we'll go tank again. I kind of enjoyed it the first something. time. They deployed an entire assault force to occupy the region. Push the enemy back and secure the site. They'll try to slow you down. Don't let them. Stay focused. Stay aggressive. Ah, oh, I didn't change it. Thank you for the reminder, but I didn't change it. <laughs> You're already hyped for Battlefield next year? How do you know it's coming out next year, bro? As far as I know, nothing's been confirmed yet. Dang it, the AI are taking me out. I don't want to shoot AI, I want to shoot the real players. Alright, we're gonna go up on the outside because this is boring uh, down the middle. Let's get our flank and stank. Oh. Shit, it's a railgun tank. He's gonna own me. This is over. Oh, he's coming for the reps. I'm sorry, buddy. Fuck. I don't remember the tank last time. I guess my team. Blew it up before uh, it had a chance to get us. Hey, Max, how you doing, dude? I'll spawn on this thing. Yeah, I will drop down. I will be a part of this cap. That parachute latency, man. It's terrifying every time. There's no hunter! All objectives captured. The sector is ours. Support package Somebody's available. still over here. Get out of here. Oh, shit. He got a revive up. Forty feels pretty fun. Oh no, that's a railgun tank. Ow! You got me, buddy. Thank you. Okay, we're just gonna. Aw, it'd be nice if you could crawl into this. Sneaky beaky. Oh, 
don't see anything, Tur. Hello. Oh, that's terrifying. Was there another machine gun you guys wanted me to test out? Also, let me, uh... Let me modify the uh, tank so that it has... We'll do heat for now. And we'll do smoke... Thermal smoke package. And a repair system. XM8? Okay. What do we got for optics? Okay, it seems like they're kind of doing the like... The smart optic is the option. Okay, still limited to 100 rounds. Uh, what do we got? A bipod and then laser? I guess I'll go laser for now. So we got su basically two suppressor options. So we could try those. Kind of weird though, to be honest. Well, I got them now. So once my tank is done for, then we'll, we'll switch over. I got thermal optics. Oh, heat has a way more um, drop to it now. Did they balance it out finally? Oh shit, the railgun tank's about to dominate me. Is heat not the round I want? It's not doing the splash like I remember. Oh shit. Get out of here, bro. That railgun tank is just owning me every chance it gets. Okay, let's see if we can get the rep done. Oh no! If we can get past here, that the railgun tank sniping me. Guy not dead. You see how many hits went into him? Yay, my smoke blocks locks. All I've ever wanted. Well, at least we got the guy who killed us. All right, let's try this suppressed XM8. This is going to be garbage. I, I can feel it. Got a bit of kick to it for sure. It's amazing, guys. Everybody use this gun. Somebody close? What am I hearing? Hmm. Yeah, it doesn't sound suppressed, does it? Hey, hey, hey! Oh, shh. The smoke goes away. There's four guys sitting right there. Oh, the HG, the heat. Okay. Yeah, I'm trying to remember which was the splash damage stuff. I have to reset all of my loadouts for the beta build. So I'm like trying to remember. Well, that guy's being a hero. Oh no. no. They were ready. They were ready for us. Let's see, can I get up here? 
Yeah, it seems like I can. Our troops are advancing on I don't Charlie think, One. I don't think this is gonna be able to lock from up here, but I can Our spot two hundred meters. Fire team sighted. Marking danger. Yeah, I'm not going to be able to hit anyone from up here, annoyingly. Let's see. Can we get up on the highway? Is this the best location? God, that terrifies me. Alright. I'm going to spend my time shooting at the AI while the real players kill me. Oh, it's really not good. I have my anti-tank grenade. Just kind of like a mediocre rate of fire, mediocre damage, mediocre accuracy. My initial feelings of it. Maybe there's a different loadout that'll make it better. Ow! Yeah, I'll probably switch out for the XM8 now. There are reports of a tornado making landfall. Avoid that wind tunnel. It'll rip you to pieces. Tornadoes, guys. All right. Ow. Oh, man. Yeah, suppressor probably did make it much worse. It's already a costly battle. What would be the other one that got upgraded? The M60 or something? I thought the M60 already got messed with. Map doesn't look much better. Well, it doesn't look better when the dust storm's on, that's for sure. We go recon for a little bit just to mix it up. Can't. Okay, well, thought I was gonna be able to see, but now I can't. Oh my gosh! This dude's owning us through the the fog. It's so weird that my death cam is still. It looks like a player aiming. I think that's just the beta server stuff. There's the tornado. Is it going to miss the combat zone entire? Oh, it sucks somebody up. Oh, no. Oh, is the range on this thing better now? Holy crap. Oh my god. Our forces are moving to attack Charlie One. Oh, that's an AI. I missed the AI shot. That was not an AI though. Oh no. This is not gonna end well for me. Oh, so close, man. <laughs> it's pretty hard to set up uh, like a base or I don't know where to attack this point from it's this one's pretty tough because you have to like just push in from the middle I, don't, I see barely anybody on our team that's even alive right now some cover. Dude, the smoke disappears and all of a sudden you're like super exposed. 
How many shots does it take to take those down? Not too many. Can't even see this guy, man. Finally, man, my god. Now he's getting revived. God, that guy's fast. Our attack on Charlie One is underway. I'm not really sure how that shot missed. We can go support. Use a little bit of the G36. We actually on the point? It's like we're actually making it through. This is it, men. Our time has come. Thank you. Finally. I can't see the dudes, man. All objectives are under our control. All right. We got it somehow. Tank. Shooting at us from range. Okay. Requesting range of drop at these coordinates. Take this sector, the whole site falls. Objective set. No. Begin your attack on that objective. We need a transport vehicle deployed at my marker. I'll take a vehicle. I don't want to drive a, over there. We can go to. D2, maybe. What is my PC build? It's fast, man. I'll tell you. It's 4090 in like one of the new AMD chips. It's, it's quite nice. I do like it. That's AI though. We'll be like in this building back here, I think. Fuck. What the hell got him, man? <laughs> mm. Yeah, latency is crazy. Bad Company 3 would be GOAT. Yeah, I don't think the next game is going to be Bad Company, but it would be neat. Multiple hostiles, mark 130 meters away. Hostile located. Oh. Oh, did I survive that? Take it. Somebody spawn on me. Initiated by our troops. I swear I hear somebody to my left. Okay. I think we can move in now. Let's go, man. We're gonna take it. Somewhere in there. Stadium rip? Yeah, stadium is rip. Where does this map rework rank compared to the rest? Um, I don't know, man. 
still holding out. We're it's one of my least favorite maps to begin with, so it's better now, but I don't think it's gonna be like one of the maps that I like am looking forward to playing. I also really don't like Death Storms. I haven't liked them since I started doing them in the like OG Battlefield games. Or not OG, but like BF3, BF4 stuff. I think it was BF4. I don't know if BF3 had the Death Storm. I can't remember. Who is hacking us, man? Okay. Uh-oh. Thanks, spotted. That would be a real gun tank. Remember your training. We might need to get out of this guy's worse vehicle. Fights than this. Yeah, that grenade launcher is good. This guy knows what he's doing. No way. That guy survived. Well, somebody got him. We're still in it. Sick jump, bro. Alright, let's go. Alright, team cleaned him up. Oh, that looks sick. Oh, it's reloading slow. So slow. Nice. Ah, uh, it's a good run, sir. All right. I think we can get in here and help finish finish the cap. I can't tell if it's um, because I'm playing on the beta build and some of my visual settings are off, but the map seems a little higher contrast in certain areas that makes visibility a little bit trickier than I'm used to. Wildcat dropped me real fast. We got it? Oh, they're capping D1 now. Too many. Come on, guys. We can do it. Be cool if Stadium was in the middle. Yeah, like, if they put Stadium there or something, they could do some fun stuff with it for sure. Oh, no. I should have spawned an Engineer. There's a bunch of vehicles around there. Crap. So dead. Nope. Okay, we're back to Angie's. 
I mean, this guy's giving us a good sort of spawn opportunity, but can't really do much. I don't have the teammates around me. Oh my god, look at that visibility. It was dark. Alright, let's see. Oh my god. No, come on, man. <laughs> we got flanked so hard there. This thing is going down. That guy dropped me? It must have been a combination of damage. The city fight does feel a little better, like in general, more cover. got to be getting this one soon, right? Okay, we have D2. We're losing D1. I'm going to stay back and fight for D2. Oh, it's always always goes, man. I need to get out of this tank, though. That thing's almost dead. I hate that it doesn't go up there. It's place I... Action. Objective captured. Oh my gosh. No longer secure. Ow, what is hitting us, man? Oh uh, yeah. Thank you, Hello Cube. All right. I think that actually wraps it up there. I'm being told now on Discord that the the test is over. So this patch is going live tomorrow. And you guys will be able to test it out for yourselves. And this is the final map rework for Battlefield 2042. So all of the original launch maps are done getting their reworks. I'm not super excited about any of the portal weapons. The 2249 actually does play decently well, but um, I'd want to play with it a little bit more. Yes. Before Time like making action. any sort of conclusion on it. That was, that's looking good. Um, but yeah. I hope you guys enjoyed the stream. I'd be curious to hear what you thought about the map um, once the stream goes live as a video too, you know? I'd be curious to hear in the comments uh, what you think. I was reading you guys a bit on chat there. I think the biggest disappointment overall is the stadium not coming back. There are much improved areas of the map both for Breakthrough and Conquest. Um, it's nowhere near the size that it was before. But that could be a good thing. It could be a bad thing, depending on what you like. It does feel more vehicle heavy for the most part. And that could that's okay. It just depends on how much vehicles you like in a map. I think if you like less vehicles in a map, then this one still might kind of irk you a little bit. But other than that, thank you guys so much for dropping by. Thanks for hanging out. Um, and I'll catch you next time. Peace out.